Your Mark 6 programming menu offers many individually definable parameters, including two of the most recognizable performance adjustments, speed and response. Most of you familiar with Mark 6 and Mark 5 programming screens will recognize these two performance adjustments and their standard values of 100. Let's explore why this is so. Speed and response are located above the performance adjustment menu on your handheld programmer or SD card enabled joystick programming screen. The standard values for speed and response are both 100 and can be adjusted using the up and down arrows on your handheld programmer. The performance adjustment speed pertains to the maximum overall speed. Any change to speed will affect all speed parameters in all drives, which includes forward turning and reverse speed. A value of 100 for speed means that the power wheelchair is performing at the true performance adjustment setting levels for that drive or drives. Invicare recommends, and most wheelchair professionals agree, that speed should be kept at 100 and any adjustments to the speed of the power wheelchair are accomplished through forward turning and braking speed. Here's why. If forward speed is set to 65, reverse speed to 35, and turning speed to 15, and speed is set at 100, it means that the speed performance adjustments are set to 65%, 35%, and 15%, respectively, of the speed setting. If speed is decreased to, say, 90, then the forward speed setting of 65 will not result in the wheelchair operating at 65% of the maximum overall speed that the system is capable of traveling. If reducing or increasing a speed function like forward, turning, or reversing is the goal of the professional, then it is recommended that those individual performance adjustments are defined for the consumer's need and speed is kept at 100. Response sets the maximum overall response of the power wheelchair to joystick commands. A value of 100 or 100% 100 means the power wheelchair is performing to the true performance adjustment setting levels for that driver drives for the same reasons we described when discussing speed. Response can be increased to as much as 200% for quicker joystick response or lowered for softened or delayed response to joystick commands. Any change to response will affect both tremor dampening and traction, two important performance adjustments covered in separate virtual tutor videos. A response setting of 100, however, is appropriate for most joystick drivers. But for joystick drivers that need increased responsiveness for more safety, balance, or have limited hand function, the response adjustment may be used. Thank you for watching this Mark 6 Virtual Tutor.